23 minutes after 7 o'clock, we have live coverage in Vail and in Beaver Creek today. But if you're looking for beautiful scenery, great golf, and a club that is going to deliver social activities, joining me now is Suzanne Morgan with the club at Cordillera. Good morning. Good morning, Tracy. You're always like golf ready. Do you get to play <laughs> a lot up at the club? I do. Part you of do. my job is to entertain the members and, you know, invite new members to come and see Cordillera. So, Yes, I do play a lot of golf. Okay, so to become a member at the club at Cordillera, do you need to live in Cordillera? You don't, and that's no? something oh, that a okay. lot of people mm -hmm. don't realize. I know, I guess I didn't either. So um, you don't have to have property mm -hmm. behind the gates. Okay. You can live anywhere in the Vail Valley or Denver and still have a membership with us. So that's really cool because if you do live in Denver and you come up here every weekend or something like that, you've got a, a whole bunch of golf courses. How many golf courses up there? We have four courses. Four courses. Yeah, and they span 7,000 acres from um, the valley course on mm -hmm. the s north side of I-70, and then we have three courses on the south side, this being our live cam from the mm -hmm. valley course on the north side, just in Edwards, and then as you wind your way up Squaw Creek, mm -hmm. you get away from that I-70 highway impact up to about 9,000 feet elevation into our other three mountain courses. Does the ball really go further at 9,000 feet? <laughs> Absolutely, <laughs> it does. does. It go, does it go straight Perfectly too? Perfectly straight. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we were looking at the clubhouse and a mm -hmm. live shot, and I mean, if you saw that shot, you're like me thinking, I'm just gonna go to club at Cordillera because it's just gorgeous. And the views are phenomenal from all the golf courses. Here we are taking a look at the Timber Hearth. This mm -hmm. is a part of Cordillera as well. Is it club specific? So this is our mountain course located mm -hmm. in the ranch at Cordillera, and um, we have the mountain course, Hale Irwin design, and mm -hmm. the Timber Hearth is our fine dining restaurant, open year round. Okay, so it's nice and delicious. The food is so good up there. I just ate there recently, actually, and it was so good. Yeah, we're fortunate. We have actually our chef transferred from True North about mm -hmm. two years ago, so he's an expert in the club business, Danny Woodbridge, um, and he really knows how to handle a large volume of people and members, but still do excellent quality food. And when you are talking about an expert in the club business, that's what you have at the club at Cordillera. In all of your golf courses, who are they run by? So we're managed by Troon, mm -hmm. which is the largest third-party golf management company in the world. So they know what they're doing. They do, and yeah. we all work for Troon. We all have been trained. Um, we all go to conferences. So it's just really great to be able to represent Troon in the Vail Valley. It's the first time it's ever happened. I bet, and the people speak very, very highly about the club at Cordillera and the golf courses up at Cordillera. So if somebody's thinking, all right, hey, I'm a Denver folk, or I'm, I live in Eagle, but I really like to play golf and I want a private club, they call you, they can be a member for a day. It's fun for the whole family. It's not just golf oriented. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And what I always like to remind people is because a lot of courses, you know, especially here where we live, they're only open in the summertime because obviously we ski in the winter. Right. With Troon, we have reciprocity throughout the world. So if you want to go somewhere during the winter and play one of our other courses, like in California or Florida or anywhere else warm, it's mm -hmm. just a cart fee of about $25. Wow. Yeah. That is a really cool benefit. Do mm -hmm. people really use that benefit a lot? Absolutely. I bet. Especially if you have a second home somewhere else. Mm -hmm. If you don't have to carry two different golf memberships, you can just use your one here. Wow. That's a good deal. That kind of makes it all worth it. But also just talking to Suzanne, playing golf up there, using the pools, having a social activity calendar, mm -hmm. all of that can happen. So people can just get in touch with you and be a member for a day and kind of test the waters. Yeah, absolutely. Give me a call or come by one of the clubhouses. I can be anywhere in about five minutes. All right. And we can uh, go. We have three swimming pools. Um, I think there's a group going on an ATV tour today and another group going hiking. So whatever you want to do, we can accommodate it in Cordillera. They can do it up at the club at Cordillera. She's a fast runner, so she can be anywhere in five <laughs> minutes. Suzanne, thank you so much for coming in this morning. I hope you have a wonderful day and a really great Fourth of July holiday. Suzanne Morgan is with the club at Cordillera. You can find them up in Cordillera. You don't have to live in the boundaries of Cordillera to become a club member, so definitely take advantage of that. We are going to be right back. You're watching Good Morning Vale.